Listen, y'all. People don't know what it's like to go through the things that you have gone through. People have no idea of the struggles and the troubles that you have had to deal with. People have no idea of how hard you had to fight for your life. People have no idea how you had to try to figure it out financially. And a lot of times there was nobody you can call. A lot of times there was nobody you can text. A lot of times there was nobody you can go to that had an answer to your problem. Sometimes you sat in the dark and you cried and you cried and you cried. And sometimes you paced the floor with worry and people have no idea. Because you get up every day and you present yourself like nothing is wrong, they have no idea. They have no idea. And if you really would think about it, if they had to walk in your shoes, if they had to deal with the things that you've dealt with, would they be standing here today? So I say to you, every, st every storm, every hurdle, Every struggle that you have been through have made you who you are today. And that is a strong individual. You're very strong. Nobody has no idea about your story. And people think they know and they really don't know. And if you start to talk about it, they probably would fold and crumble. Life is funny. It changes in the blink of an eye. And for those who say, well, my life ain't never been like that. I ain't never had to deal with that. I say, God bless you. I commend you for having an easy path. But don't get too happy. Don't gloat too much. Because a storm may just be brewing around the corner that you have no idea you're about to walk in. So whether you've been in a storm, whether you're coming out of a storm, or whether you Look like you going to enter or exit a storm. Be grateful for the things that you have. Be grateful for the things that you can do and be grateful for the life that you live. Because I'm telling you, it depends on whatever struggles and worries you have in your life. It can give you gray hairs and give you bags up under your eyes and sleepless nights. And as I've said time and time before, people will pat you on your back. And grin in your face and say, if you need me, I'll be there for you. I'm just a phone call away. And when that need arises and you pick up the phone to call, you won't get an answer. And then you'll get an excuse why they didn't hear your phone call. When they look right at it, roll right over and kept doing what they was doing. Because they really didn't care. Circles are small for a reason. You got to know that. Everybody is not who you think they are, including your family. They ain't who you think they are. See, love, my dad said, covers a multitude of faults. And I think that's where we miss the market. Do we have genuine love? You have to question that sometime. But whether you have genuine love or not, there is somebody who's in your corner. There is somebody who encourages you. There is somebody who motivates you. There is somebody who lifts you up. <clears throat> Those are what you call your true, authentic friends, family, people you're dating, and people that you're married to, that is always going to be in your corner. Now, them are the ones you need to hold on to. But the mother ones, you need to do your due diligence and cut the umbilical cord and let them go. Open the cage and let them fly away. They're, they don't mean you any good, and they have not been helpful in your life. They cause you more problems than you need to have. And life itself gives you a lot of problems. So, sometimes you got to sit down in silence. You got to look around. You got to evaluate, see who's in your life, see who's sitting at your table, see who, see who needs to stay. And you definitely got to see who needs to go.
And a little house cleaning don't hurt. Now, I'm not talking about no surface cleaning. I'm talking about moving some furniture around so you can see some things. So you know when you move stuff around, you can see the dirt that you were sweeping that you missed and you didn't catch. So sometimes you need to move some things around so you can see the little hid, hidden things that you didn't pay attention to. And find out those individuals who really has your best interest at heart and those who don't. Again, life is too short. It's shorter than we what we think it is. And every second, minute, hour, day, month, and year, make it count. Do your best to be the best version of yourself that you can be for you and not nobody else. Can't worry about nobody else. Your cup is already full with your own problems, with your own headaches, and with your own hassles. You don't have time to be worried about nothing nobody else got going on. It's all about you. Even when other people have problems, your problem, you got problems of your own. You ain't got time to fix nobody else stuff when your stuff going on, does it? So come on. Let's work that thing for you. Tick tock. Tick tock. Tick tock.